Okay, folks, today we're going to talk about transformers. All air handlers have a transformer. You take the transformer, you have four leads that's going to be high voltage, and two leads is your low voltage. We're going to talk about how to hook them up. This is just a real world video. First thing we're going to talk about is primary, common, which is your white wire. Common means no matter how you hook it up, you're always going to use the white wire, okay? The black is your 120 volt, the red is your 208 volt, and your orange is 240 volts. In most houses, it's going to be 240 volts, and sometimes in high-rise condos, it'll be 208 volts. So we're going to talk about this second. I'm going to take the amp probe here, and really what we're going to really discuss is resistance. Okay, always hook up your common wire. And I'm going to go to the black wire first. That's your 120 volts, as you see. And I want you to look at the meter here. Just so you know, I've got this, the meter, the field piece, set on resistance. So on the black wire, we have 20 ohms of resistance. On the red wire, it's going to be a little bit more. It's 53 ohms of resistance. On the orange wire... It's going to be even more because it's 240 volts. So what that means, the higher the resistance, the higher the voltage, the lower the amp draw is what that means. So 66 ohms resistance. So when you get out there and you check your fill piece with your fill piece and you check your voltage, you just want to check your windings. Let's go over here to the 24 volt side. Should have like one and a half ohms resistance. Okay, right there, one half ohm resistance. So if you get out there and you grab your transformer and you don't have one half ohm resistance on that side, even though you got 240 volts going in, that's your problem. It's your low voltage side. Let me show you something here. I got a bad transformer here. We already know what this does common, 120, 208, 240. I'm just going to show you the secondary winding of this. You know how we had 1.5 volts ohms or a second ago, nothing. We know this is bad. Let's go back to the good transformer. We know this is good. So you got to have one and a half ohms, 1.4 ohms resistance on the secondary side of these transformers. If you have any questions, give us a call at Jones Air Conditioning and Electrical, 239-596-5855 or jonesairconditioning.com. Thank you.